Sup guys, let's do this. What is up you guys, Claudio back again with another reaction and this time we have Star Wars Rogue One weird trailer by Alder Jones. Now, uh, I am subscribed to Alder Jones um, and I was just browsing around and came across this new trailer that he released a few days back. Now, um, Alder Jones, uh, he does very special editing to the trailers. He adds in a lot of cool stuff and Easter eggs throughout the trailer, and he kind of kind of modifies it, modifies it so it becomes pretty hilarious. At the time he's also really good at what he does, so it's very entertaining. Now, one of the things with with his trailers is that uh, those can be very hard to to uh, get everything in the first. Uh, at the first try, if you know what I mean. It's like, it's uh, a lot of details, so you miss a lot of things. Uh, so you have to rewatch the trailer a few times just to get it. And I think that is cool, so uh, that gives me the opportunity to tell you guys you can head over to, to, his, uh, to his channel and watch the trailer again a few times if you haven't already, uh, which I know most of you have. Uh, this guy is uh, pretty fucking cool. He does a lot of cool shit. His older trailers are fucking awesome. Uh, he's all totally alright with us reacting to him. Also, uh, check out his uh, his Patreon. He, he's trying to support himself now by doing YouTube full time, which is a cool thing. Uh, so he's throwing himself out there uh, and uh, sh show him some support. Um, also, drop him a like, subscribe, you know, support him in any way you can. Uh, He's a cool dude, and his trailers are fucking awesome. I don't know, what, what more can I say? Uh, anyway, I'm probably gonna miss a lot of cool stuff, as I said, but the reaction is done only once, so I'm just gonna go ahead and watch this, and then I'm gonna probably watch it a three, four times after that again. Uh, so, without further ado, let's do this. Pop! All right. The world is coming undone. <laughs> Elf! <laughs> Imperial flags rain oh. <laughs> across the galaxy. That fut Futurama? Ah, oh, that was cool. Can you be trusted with our like, shackles? Let's just get this over with, shall we? We have a mission for you. <laughs> what? <laughs> a major weapon oh, is disabled. Ah, that voice is the guy from. Uh, um, if you're really doing this, I want to help. Independence Good. Day, the first movie. Good. <laughs> I've been recruiting. For oh the my Rick God! What the hell? We destroyed our home. I fear nothing. All is as the Force wills it. <laughs> yeah, he's blind. Do you see? He smacked him over the head. You are a friend. I will not kill you. Thanks. <laughs> Every day they grow stronger. Oh uh, wow! Cool. <laughs> Baywatch, really, dude? There is a ninety-seven point six percent chance of failure. <laughs> Well. Oh my god. The hole? Okay, cool. This is our chance. <laughs> Paper, really? That is fucking awesome. <laughs> Pineapple man. Okay, cool. 
Man, this is awesome. This guy is uh, is hilarious. I really, I really enjoy his stuff, and I urge you to head over there and drop him a like. At least that's the least you could do. Man, come on. He's done so many cool trailers. I haven't reacted to all of them, but I've done a few, and this guy is fucking awesome. I'm just saying. Yeah. Thoughts. Yes, guys. Um, what the hell? You saw he's uh, he's he's super talented. He he's a cool dude. He does these trailers, and they are they are fucking epic. The shit he does, the editing skills he has are fun. The shit is it's fucking on point. He's really good at what he does. Uh, very interesting how he does that though. Uh, but you can clearly see that it's uh, <sighs> the original footage is tampered with. You can kind of see it, but he does it pretty well. So at sometimes I'm like, I don't even react to what he does or, or, or how he does it because it it flows very naturally with the original footage, and it's like, oh whoa, re oh that wasn't there originally, really? It's, it's like that. And, and the, the cool thing about these trailers is that you can watch them time and time again and you can always discover like tiny details all over the trailer. For example, I, I don't remember which one I watched, uh, one of his earlier ones, because I've seen a bunch. And uh, if you pause at the right, I guess, frame, you can see that he, he was shouting out people. Uh, you can see some really cool stuff. He like sprays in the background, like uh, write stuff on the walls, like hidden messages and all that, all that stuff related to the trailer, of course, and to uh, the community that he's in, I guess. And so this guy is this guy is pretty cool. He, he uh, I. And, and the, one of one other cool thing that he does, I, th I think, is that that he he releases the trailer in different languages. I think, because uh, if you if you head over to his channel, you can see that uh, he has the, the same trailer, but in Italian as well. I think he's Italian. I'm not sure. Uh, Italian and Spanish and French and a bunch of other languages. So it's it's very. Uh, I guess. It's very cool that way because I mean not everybody understands English and uh, he's very aware of that so, so that is cool you know uh, uh, the talking uh, star destroyer um, he was the dude I don't remember the character's name Russell something like that I I, I remember his name now. Uh, but he was the old drunk man in the first Independence movie, uh, Independence Day movie with Will Smith and uh, uh, Bill Pullman and a few others. Uh, probably remember it if you've seen it. Uh, it came back in 97 or something like 96, 97 or something. It's an old movie, but a very cool one. And he says that when he takes off in one of the planes to destroy the aliens and stuff something like that because he claims he was abducted or some shit like that from so it's from that movie it's really cool when you know so, so those small uh, it's called like easter eggs if you understand them it becomes so much more fun to watch his stuff also as i mentioned before it's way difficult to react to his stuff because he throws things at you all the time and it's really difficult to keep up at times. So that's why I watch his trailers like fucking three, four times at least. And I recommend you to head over to his uh, YouTube channel and do that as well. I would appreciate it anyway. I, I know a lot of reactors uh, uh, watch his stuff and he encouraged you to. But he's, he's one of the few content creators that, ha that has uh, understood and uh, that understands how much it can actually help you uh, in the beginning of your career, at least. 
Because when I subscribed to Aldo, he had not many thousand subscribers, and now he's uh, over 137,000, you know? Uh, and he kind of recognized that, wow, okay, so if I let people know that this is okay, then that will automatically get me some views as well, and some, some tiny, slight, tiny promo. It's, it's like, you know, if he's cool, you know, of course people are gonna shut him out. Of course people are gonna be nice to him. Of course people are gonna head over there and watch the fucking video and leave a thumbs up. I encourage people to do that. But, uh, yeah, he, he's very aware of that. And that, that is a cool thing, you know, because he encourages you to, to do reaction videos to his stuff. Because he's fucking funny. It is. I really enjoy his content. I really, really do. And that's why I've subscribed to him. That's why I always leave a like, at least. And, uh, yeah, man, I... As I said, I urge you guys to do the same. It would be really cool if you did that. Uh, also, let me know in the comment section below what you thought about this. Uh, drop me a like. I would appreciate it. I always do. And uh, yeah, man. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next video.